Peggy 18. New Bordeaux is our New Orleans, where we took all of the best parts and we put it into one place. We have the bayou in the south, it's this big swamp area, there's alligators swimming around. You can go to the wharf district or you can go to the docking district, that's where all the shipment happens, that's where the actual trade happens. It's really cool because it doesn't matter where you are in the city, it looks unique and has its own character. The city's made up of nine unique districts. Each district has two criminal rackets and all the sort of criminal ecology that revolves around that racket. The districts are really unique as well, from the hollow where Lincoln is sort of uh, born and raised and sort of very poor area of the, the city to the very iconic sort of French ward area, which is your classic Bourbon Street, Canal Street area of New Bordeaux. It's sort of, it's jazz bars, it's neon lights and it's bustling sort of nightlife. As well as that, we have the posh sort of suburban area of Frisco Fields. The city really is a unique character in our game and the city is king for us. It really is important. The way in which we can unlock the city just story-wise, it's always going to be fully available. If you want to drive around, you want to find things, you want to explore, it's going to be there. But the specific story beats that are going to take place in the city are actually very much tied to your quest of taking down Marcano. So as you're making your progress, you're going to visit new parts of the city because they're going to unlock various characters and they're actually going to illuminate the way that the mob operates in those districts. Mm -hmm.